Oh, I'll get that Hydra. Owie, looks like the Bone Hydra of Asphodel just stomped you that time, huh? I hear each of its heads has its own nasty tricks. That must be tough. It was unpleasant, yes. Worthless blessings here within my realm. Our realm. Explain to me how exactly this is possible, Nix. Either your limitless power has considerably waned, or you are up to something. Do not question my power, Hades. Your son was bound to be discovered the closer he came to the surface. The Olympians are pleased to know they have a distant relative and bid him welcome to their mountain. That is all. Their influence is very limited. Blood and darkness, do not speak to me about their influence. I've seen their influence firsthand. You've made a foolish mistake. You would speak to me of foolish mistakes. You cannot change the course that has been set. Try all you like. Nix. Ah. Cerberus must be asleep somewhere. The sealed weapons by your chambers. Your father won't observe their absence, I don't think. They remind him of a time he stood together with his brothers and sisters. He wants nothing more to do with any of that. I think it's fitting you've inherited their power. The power that once sealed away the Titans. Maybe it's a power that can break me out of here. Thank you for helping me, Achilles. This is for me. You really shouldn't have. You're spoiling me rotten. I just happen to think you deserve better than you've got down here, Achilles. Approved. Should make a nice enough addition to my chambers. No time to rest. I, uh, hope you're having a nice stay. Even though you don't want to live here anymore, Your Highness. And there she goes again. Son returns. Everyone's saying I went easy on you, Zag. Don't worry, Meg. I eventually managed to get home the painful way after all. Look, I have a reputation to uphold. You get past me again like that, you best go all the way. Now leave me be and don't think you're gonna be so lucky next we meet out there. The lounging area within the House of Hades is a dismal place to be, in spite of its intended purpose to enliven the house's grim inhabitants. It's better than nothing. What's in stock?
I want to go lie down. I'll just set that there. How many times has it been? It is the dead of night, or the approximation of it in the realm of Hades. Prince of the Underworld, Zagreus, rises from a fitful slumber, with much mischief on his mind. Mischief? Me? I was just going to have a little look through Father's stuff. All is quiet at this time. Ever-dreaming Hypnos put a spell upon the house, as willful Zagreus had asked of him. All are fast asleep, save for the prince. It is exact. Lower your voice, old man. I'm trying to be sneaky here. He ventures toward the stately throne of his lord father, half expecting to be caught, but ill expecting what he is about to find. I said shut up, old man. He does not know exactly what he seeks. He only knows that something always has felt off to him, that he does not belong. Who is he, really? Lord Hades never would indulge such questions, so Prince Zagreus would find out for himself. I'm not listening. He rifles through his Lord Father's possessions, there is not much of any import there. Ledgers and administrative parchment work. Correspondence from Olympus which he had ignored. No trace of any reference to his son. But then, there is the note. Written finally in a hand and voice the likes of which the prince had never seen or heard. Hades. I can no longer tolerate my life here in this place. So I'm leaving, even if it kills me. I won't be returning to Olympus. If there is a place where I belong in this world, it must be somewhere between heaven and hell. Perhaps it's on the coast and has a little garden. Take care of Cerberus. I shall miss him. Persephone. Thus did Prince of the Underworld Zagreus absorb the contents of this hidden letter, written in his mother's hand. His mother's hand? My mother's hand? Wait, what? You're saying this Persephone, that she's my mother? But... but Father always said that Nyx was m That liar. He lied to me. They both did. All my life. Uh, thus did the prince discover, inadvertently, the well-kept truth about his lineage. Entirely by chance, this did occur. Persephone, the one-time queen of all the underworld. Where had she gone? And why? Engulfed by newfound questions and his rage, the prince decided to confront his lord and master. You... why? You... you're... Nix, you're not my mother. All this time, you and my father, you... you lied to me? Oh, my dear child. So now you know. So now you know. But only half the truth. I can explain the rest, so... Please. It never was my wish to hurt you. Mother, I wonder, will you even remember me? Let's see. Felt that, I think.
Hey, uh, something back there for you, pal. Hey, Skelly, you look like you know your way around Tartarus. Found some of this ancient Titan blood out there, and I was looking to score some more. Ah, you come to the right place regarding that there, pal. It's your mean weapons back there that can find this stuff. Once you get all the way through Tartarus with one, that's all the blood you're gonna get. For the time being, anyhow. How am I supposed to keep track of which weapons I've earned these with, then? I don't know. There's always the invention of writing stuff down. You'll figure something out. Another weapon. It's sealed shut. Let's see what that one does. This ought to be good. Pretty good. No turning back. Family. Death is your only family. Death and I. Best to get accustomed to the both of us. No, not on your life. Hey, I once heard Lord Hades has in his employ the greatest hero of the Trojan War. You happen to know anything about that? I'm kind of a fan. You see, Achilles, tell him he's the best for me. Sacrifice some of my life essence to go in here. Oh, I don't see why not. Who or what is that? Within the underworld's quietest, most solitary, darkest abyss lies hidden evidence of the beginning of all things, of chaos the most ancient sculptor that has shaped this world. I'd best take all the evidence I find. This is not someone I recognize. So, in the name of Hades, um, hello, may I ask who's calling? The beings have all grown soft. Would you not agree? Um, have we met? Although we have met, in a way, I know everybody here, and there. 
and you wish to leave this place, then it is my wish to make your doing so a little bit more interesting. And if you encounter the Olympians someday, do give them my regards. to extract the benefits a few chambers from now. Charon's shop. Charon, mate. Now, hypothetically, if I provided you with, say, a thousand coins, would you be willing to give me a ride in your beautiful boat? Upriver, I should say, specifically. I had to ask. than a hundred foes since you began your quest. You have, for I am keeping count, and I am most impressed. is far enough. Then here we go. You 
lived through all that. There. Gods grant me strength. Good. That's good. Doomstone. Just great. giant evil crystal then. The Solon Optimus reached out to you, did she? Oh, that's adorable, dearest. Just don't make any sudden movements with her, hmm? Damned lost souls with nowhere left to turn congregate in deepest Tartarus, where they fuse together with the earth itself into odious forms which defy description. They basically turn into big crystals. Kieran's shop. Ah. 
Oh, hello. Hold it, Zagreus. I sense something. Is that... Ah. Uh, you've been in contact with Chaos. So even they are now involved with this. Just because Chaos is giving me the power to crush you doesn't mean they're getting involved with this, does it? You don't know who or what you're dealing with. Ask Nyx about them for me sometime. Here, I'll give you a chance to ask her very soon. some sort of power, but for what? It seems the Fury failed to do her job. The path from Tartarus is finally laid bare. Far above. The heat from Phlegathon, the river of flame, is faintly felt already, even as its dangers lie in wait. Lovely. but up. Wasn't this whole expanse once lush and green?
to. In the name of Hades. singing here come on in okay hey you must be the Hades kid how's it going then your royal majesty nice to meet you I'm Eurydice what brings a big important guy like you up to a place like this hi there no need for formalities I'm Zagreus just heading out on some official business, past the menacing Bone Hydra. Don't mean to be rude, though I'm in a bit of a rush. Well, don't you have your hands full, hon? I'll let you go. But there's one rule in my place, which is... Nobody leaves here empty-handed. You got that? So take your pick. My treat. Coming right up. Hmm, really hit the spot. Bye now. See you next time. Burn flingers. Father.
right along.